Hail is loving universe at Xander, we'll the Fire Emblem Fates. Xenolog. Royal Royale. Um. Wait, is this really the right place, Elise? Well... It should be, but I don't see anyone here. Hmm. How strange. Could this letter be some kind of sort of cruel practical joke? If you want to save Corin, come to this location. It could also be a trap. True. But we can't take any chances. This is Corin's life we're talking about. Hey. Perhaps we should pull back for the time being and consult with the others. <gasps> Wait a second, I hear footsteps. <sighs> Thank you for coming, young princes as princesses of Nor and Hoshido. <gasps> oh my gosh, you're the Rainbow Sage. <laughs> yes, there are some who call me by that name. But the truth is I am not I'm a being not of this world. In fact, I come from a different place altogether. I preside over the possible world. What? What do you mean? Yeah. I require your assistance. I I must borrow the strength of one of one from the finished world. This is why I wrote that letter. Uh... Sorry for being rude earlier. I had no idea it was you. <gasps> so, just to clarify, Mr. Uh, Sage, is Corin really in danger? Indeed. I'm afraid so. But it is not the Corin you know. The Corin of another world is in mortal peril. <laughs> Wait a minute, another world? What are you talking about? Hear me out. Listen closely now. The Corrin I wish to save lives in their own ongoing world. Her world has been embroiled in a fierce war which has been devastating the land. In fact, it's quite similar to the one you ladies recently fought in. No! What? what But that's impossible! <sighs> no, it's the truth. Corrin has chosen a path and is fighting tooth and nail for the future. But more power is required in order to help her along the way. That is why I require assistance. Will you lend me your strength? Hmm? What does that mean exactly? You want us to go to that world so we can fight? No. Unfortunately, I don't possess the ability to send you there. Instead, you all must spar. That way, we can determine which among you is the mightiest warrior. Only then will we be able to assist Korin on her journey. What? You can't be serious. How could I possibly fight Sakura, Hanoka, and Camilla? We're family. Uh. You, you don't want us to fight to the death, do you? Don't be ridiculous, of course not. I simply need to tap into the power of whomever of you is the strongest. If everything goes well, we may be able to make something to aid Corin. Really? Yeah. I never lie. So will you help? Yeah. Of course. I don't care if it's an entirely different world. I would do anything for sweet Corin. Uh -huh. As would I. Our Corin fought bravely beside us. It's our turn to help her. <laughs> I had a feeling you'd be up for the t contest. Why, just earlier today, your brothers all made the same decision. Hmm? W what Xander and Leo? <gasps> and Ryoma and Takami as well? Indeed. They all agreed to take on the challenge without a moment of hesitation. They're willing to do whatever it is necessary to help Corin. I see that you are no different. You obviously have a great deal in common with them. <laughs> well, of course. We all got- we've all gone through a lot together. <laughs> There's no way I'll lose this battle. I'll win for Corin. Nuh-uh, you gotta get through me, sis. I can do this! You're both wrong! I- I'm going to triumph! Well, well, I can see that you're not lacking in enthusiasm. How very promising. I'm curious to see who will emerge victorious. Now then, I'll transport you to the battleground. I've taken the liberty of summoning your retainers. I wish you the best of luck. Okay, well, I played as Camilla last time and got my ass kicked. So... Let's give it... Let's try it. Let's try again. Let's try not to screw it up this time. Oh, if we could get up there. I need to mark Takami because he's got the Fujin Yumi still. This is the freaking Fire Emblem Hunger Games right here. I'm just marking the archers because I know everyone's got... I know a lot of people have the have bow and arrows. Okay. We get down here. We can hit... Um, Oh, I should have done Rally. Okay, so they're all going to do Rally, I'm sure. So what I should do is Fire Orb. 
I can't hit any of them. Okay. So I should draw them out first. What the hell? So what I'm seeing here is I could have an army of Camilla, Baruka, and... Yeah, I ain't complaining. I could have an army of Camilla, Baruka, and Selena. And if I'm correct, using the item works on the other Camilla as well? I didn't get a chance to check. Yes, it does. Okay. Camilla's axe, probably the best option here. Okay, no dialogue from Saizo. Kind of makes sense, though. He's a man of few words. She is a replica. This is very interesting. This gets rid of all of Ryoma's retainers. Uh, there we go. Okay, and yeah, Ryoma does 14, but that's just the replica, correct? I could be wrong. I don't I don't actually remember. Oh, and Hanoka's gonna come join the fight. It looks like. But that's not Hanoka, that's that's Tsubaki. Oh shit. Is that the real Camilla? Yeah, that was the real Camilla. That was, in fact, the real Camilla that Ryoma just murdered. So we'll do what we can. I mean, I don't want to have to restart this, but if I have to, I guess it's kind of a matter of so be it, I will. Are you shitting me? So yeah, I'm definitely going to have to restart. Try that again. You know what? I think I'm going to try a different team this time. I like Camilla, but she... I, I, I'd honestly go out and say Camilla's my favorite of the siblings at this point. Do that again. I'm not doing two videos in a row where I'm like, okay, I'm just going to show you the endings. And who knows, I might do rede a redemption run on Beach, ba Beach Brawl or something. I'm sure that I can beat it in the video at some point. You know what? Let's go Team Ryoma. Since that's the team that just wiped me out. Do that, it's fine. Okay, so we can hit this. Freeze our enemies. Get duplicates of ourselves. Oh, here we go. This will do some damage. 
And if I lose this one, I'll just play as a different team. Honestly. There we go. This will get... This gets Baruch out of the picture. Alright. Unfortunately, I've sent the replicas in first, so... Oh, you got a 22% chance of crit. I'm hoping you get it. This works. Don't forget me. That worked. And now Selena tries to attack any of us. We're all using ranged attacks, so... Okay, she's hurting the replica, so it's fine. That doesn't affect the real one. And can we get more replicas if we do that? Like, can we have, like, three or four of the same character? Alright, there's the real Ryoma. Oh, shoot. Uh, I think the replicas actually do share damage with us, though. Okay, it kind of looks like these two are about to head into a fight with one another. So, maybe stay out of their way. I say that, but Sakura and Leo's sides have not started fighting, so... Yeah, why not? Yeah, why not? Let's get to it. Worth a shot. I'm so sorry. Yeah, I actually was considering uh, playing. I will admit, I was actually considering playing as um, either Takami or Ryoma for this one, since I did play as Camilla in. Beach Brawl. I mean, I got my ass thoroughly handed to me in Beach Brawl, but point remains, I did play as Camilla for it. Alright. Arthur's out of here. I think the replica's out front, but I think the replica also... The replica does share health with the main one, though, doesn't it? Yep. That is actually pretty annoying. Just go ahead and get Takami out of the way. Get rid of the shell horn. I need to use these items. Really? That's bull. What a bull load of bull. That better be the last person who can attack Ryoma. You know, maybe we should, um, see how far Effie can go, and get, like, the hell out of there. We stand together. Let's see what they've got. Okay, we're gonna be fine.
I mean, this guaranteed gets rid of Leo, at least. God, I don't... Well, I, I guess we don't use magic. It's fine. We're about to find out what happens if I summon more replicas. We're under attack. So at least we'll be doing that for science. Yeah, I think playing as Ryoma was the best option. I think Xander would have been the second best option. These guys are just getting their asses whooped. I'll just replace the one concoction with the two, I suppose. Okay, it's time to find out what happens if I do this. Am I gonna get four replicas instead of just two? Are these replicas gonna vanish and we get... Uh, well, that's actually what I expected. This next. I'm staying away from Effie. <laughs> All transparency here. Staying fully away from her. All that remains are Hanoka, her retainers... And Xander and his retainers, as well as Effie. So I'm gonna try and surround Effie here and like double team her with both Ryomas. And then we'll go for Hanoka, and then we'll go for the epic battle of Xander Ryoma. Or Xander versus Ryoma Ryoma. And uh, also Ryoma and Ryoma. Uh, they're get she's getting close real fast. I don't like that. She can go five steps. I can only go seven. Oh, I can't get out of her range! I'm trying to get the other Ryoma up here so we can actually double team. God, I can't move that far? What the hell? Why can't I move that far? Okay, now she's moving down. Oh, Hanoka's moving towards us now. I swear it's like Effie smells blood in the water or something. Because she is... She is right on my tail. And I don't know why Ryan was struggling to move. Why have I not used the Seraph robe? Well, in the words of Frederick, time to pick a god and pray. Oh god, Hinoka's coming. Hinoka can't attack me from a distance, so we can hope for a crit. Okay, not a crit, but better than nothing. Oh god, she's gonna do uh, 36 damage. Oh, come on! Okay, we're good. Alright, let's get Hinoka out of here if we can. Ryoma, I'm begging you. 44%, that's almost 50 50. Dude, really? Not exactly thrilled with that. Good luck. And yep. Dude! Wrong side! That's stupid. Well, that's stupid as hell right there. Okay, Kagero actually has worse luck here. Alright, Ryoma, you gotta hit it eventually. Let's get to it. There it is. And Kagero does have Azura Sol Speedwing. Concoction first. Definitely need that first. Because Setsuna's about to attack. It's okay, Setsuna can't do much. Okay. Get over here with Ryoma. I know it seems kind of dumb that I'm running, but I'm doing it for a reason. Do that. That should make it where we can attack twice on some people. Not sure if it'll work for everyone, but at least for some people. There we go. 
What are we getting out of that? Concoction. Oh, yes. Okay, now Xander's on the move. Unfortunately, I don't have anyone that can do that. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. Alright, I can finally start coming down here with Ryoma. Replica Ryoma, but, you know. I just gotta get the two Ryomas close to each other. The main problem there is Siegfried is going to destroy my ass. Oh, he's about to do 32 damage. Xander is actually my biggest problem right now. Because uh, even if I get a crit, that's only 15 damage. That's not even half of his health. Can't even take out Parry because she's got a ranged weapon. Honestly, I think the best choice is to run away and use another concoction to get back to full health. Xander's still going to chase after me, as is Parry. Granted, Parry can't hit me, unfortunately. Xander can. He will. He's going to do a shit ton of damage. Unless... There's all a bunch of one damage hits, isn't it? Okay, that might... That might be the turning point. Here we go. Damn it! She doesn't have any concoction. Uh, can I get both of them out of the danger zone? I can. Let's get both of you out of the danger zone for a minute. Draco shield. United we stand, Ryomas. It's almost over. I'm legitimately saving Effie for last, yes. I'm that much of a wimp. Really? There we go. Can we get a concoction? Nope. Honestly, I'm surprised Azama didn't try and heal Effie. Okay, we're actually about to win this, surprisingly. Oh! Well, I was gonna have her use the Azura Solve, but... That works, too. Game. Set. Match. Twenty-eight turns. We're done here. The battle is over. We have emerged victorious. You two fought valiantly. Thank you, Lord Ryoma. Our triumph was all but assured. Yes. Indeed, you barely needed our assistance. No. Nonsense. I owe you my thanks. 
The success would have been impossible without your aid. Uh, Interesting. So the victor represents the strength and virtue of Hoshida. That's right. Right you are, Rainbow Sage. I can't say I'm terribly surprised. But congratulations to you and your retainers nonetheless. Now then, would you be so kind as to place your hands together? Yes. Of course. I who forge the sacred blade. I who commit the great sin. I who wove the divine colors. I request a bold new power. <laughs> Excellent. It seems as though the ritual worked perfectly. Thanks to your extraordinary triumph, new objects of power have been born. Mm -hmm. What are these objects exactly? Yes. This is an energy drop, and the other is called a Dread Scroll. They are, they are proof of your party's triumph. I am certain that they will be a great help to Corrin in the other world. I see. Excellent. Thank you for your help, Rainbow Sage. No. I should be thanking you, Lord Ryoma. I'm grateful for all of your help. Regardless of the path she follows, you and Corrin will always share a bond. Your feelings for Corrin will transcend the distance between worlds. Should you wish to grant her more power, come to me again, brave warrior. I will always be waiting. Ooh, Dread Scroll. It's actually a seal item. It's a special item. You know, I'll show it real quick. Don't know if I'm going to use it, but... I know I got it in... Oh, right. Yeah, I haven't done these yet. Um, well, who's someone that we don't use much that I'm okay with showing this with? Right here, we'll show it on Leo real quick. Dread Scroll. Changes unit to a Dread Fighter class. Now, uh, dread fighters use swords, axes, and shurikens. So let's find someone okay with having used swords, axes, and shurikens. Um, it's only for male classes. It's only for males, though, I believe. Never mind, Rajat could use it. That's actually kind of... I think, I, for some reason, I thought in Awakening only males could use it. You know what, here, we'll show it on Kana, since... You know what? No, I know who to use it on. We'll get him next time. Thanks for watching. I'll show. I promise. I'm leaving you on the cliffhanger of. We'll show the Dread Scroll next time. Thank you all for watching this episode of Fire Emblem Fates DLC. Go to the video and like. Tell me in the comments down below what you the series so far. And of course, don't forget to subscribe. It's free. It's easy to mount. I'll see you all tomorrow for the next bit of action. Xander out. <laughs>